Welcome to Electron Line. In this video, we're going to talk about tangent lines, especially when it refers to circles. So here we have a circle, and whenever we draw a line that's tangent to the circle, which means that the circle and the tangent line have one point in common where they touch, or another way of saying that is that the tangent line intersects the circle at one point. Well, when we draw a line from the center circle to the point that the tangent line and the circle have in common, that line, the tangent line, and the line from the center to the edge of the circle meeting up at the tangent line will be perpendicular to one another. So tangent lines are considered to be perpendicular to the circle at the point where they touch, and it's perpendicular to the line drawn from the center to the edge of the circle where they meet, and that's then also called the radius of the circle. Well, when we have two circles and we draw a line where they touch, and yeah, they touch both circles right there. So when they touch both circles at the same time, that is then called a common tangent or a common tangent line. The tangent line can either be external to the circles or it can be internal to the circles. So they're called a common external tangent line and a common internal tangent, tangent or tangent line. Either one, either one is fine. And then we can have a situation where the two circles are side by side like this, where they touch at one single location. And then if we draw a line that runs between the two circles and also touches both circles at the same time at that very same point, that is then called an externally tangent situation. In other words, the circles are externally tangent. But if we draw the second circle inside the first circle and then they all touch at the very same point, they all have one point in common where the tangent line touches the outside circle and the inside circle, then we call this that the circles are what we call internally tangent. So here the circles are externally tangent, here the circles are internally tangent. So those are some basic terminology, some basic terms for tangent lines when it deals with tangent lines and circles. And that's how it is.